Princess Sophia's Enchanted Opera, a tale of laughter and magic. Once upon a time, in the magical kingdom of Enchantia, there lived a young and spirited princess named Sophia. Princess Sophia was known for her kindness, curiosity, and love for adventure. One bright and starry evening, the royal family of Enchantia decided to attend a grand opera performance at the Royal Theatre. The Royal Theatre was a magnificent structure adorned with golden pillars, draped in rich velvets, and filled with the enchanting melodies of the kingdom's most talented musicians. The entire kingdom was abuzz with excitement as the citizens prepared for this grand event. As the royal family entered the theater, Princess Sophia's eyes widened with amazement. The chandeliers sparkled like a thousand stars, and the air was filled with the sweet fragrance of roses. The anticipation in the theater was palpable as the curtains prepared to rise. The opera was a tale of love, magic, and adventure, with knights and princesses at the center of the story. The performers sang with passion, filling the theater with their melodious voices. Princess Sophia was enthralled by the enchanting tale unfolding before her. As the second act neared its climax, a series of comical mishaps occurred backstage. The lead actress, who was supposed to play the princess, accidentally tripped on her gown and twisted her ankle. The backstage chaos reached the ears of the theater manager, who rushed to find a solution. In the midst of the commotion, Princess Sophia's eyes met those of the theater manager. He had a twinkle in his eye and an idea forming in his mind. With a gracious bow, he approached the royal family. Your Majesties, he began. We are facing an unexpected challenge backstage and I have a daring proposition. Princess Sophia, with her charm and grace, could step in to play the role of the princess in this opera. It would be a delightful surprise for the audience, and I believe she would shine on the stage. The king and queen exchanged glances and then looked at Princess Sophia. Her eyes sparkled with excitement, and she nodded eagerly. The decision was made Princess Sophia would take the stage. Backstage. Princess Sophia was fitted into a beautiful gown adorned with shimmering jewels. The theater manager explained the script, and Princess Sophia, ever the quick learner, absorbed the lines and cues with enthusiasm. She was determined to make the opera a memorable experience for everyone. As the curtains rose for the third act, the audience was surprised to see Princess Sophia, not the expected actress, on stage. Whispers and murmurs filled the air, but soon the enchanting presence of the young princess captured their attention. Princess Sophia's natural grace and charm brought a new energy to the opera. She delivered her lines with sincerity, her voice echoing through the grand theater. The audience was captivated, and soon they were swept away by the magic of the moment. Unbeknownst to Princess Sophia, a mischievous fairy named Twinkletoes who loved to create laughter and joy, had sprinkled a pinch of fairy dust on the stage. As Princess Sophia sang, the fairy dust worked its magic, causing amusing and unexpected events to unfold. In one scene, as Princess Sophia twirled in her gown, a group of mischievous mice scurried onto the stage, creating a hilarious dance routine. The audience erupted in laughter and even the normally stern royal advisors couldn't help but chuckle. As the opera continued, Princess Sophia embraced the unexpected surprises, turning each mishap into a delightful moment. The audience was enchanted by the young princess's spirit and the magical atmosphere that filled the theater. In the final act, Princess Sophia's character was supposed to receive a magical gift from a wise wizard. However, the wizard, played by the court jester, accidentally pulled out a rubber chicken instead of the expected enchanted object. The theater echoed with laughter as Princess Sophia graciously accepted the whimsical gift, turning what could have been a disaster into a moment of pure joy. The opera concluded with a standing ovation from the audience. Princess Sophia took a humble bow, her heart filled with gratitude for the unexpected adventure 
Backstage, the theater manager approached her with a grateful smile. Princess Sophia, he said, you have brought a special kind of magic to our stage tonight. Your spontaneity and grace turned what could have been a challenge into a performance that will be remembered for years to come. As the royal family left the theater, they were met with cheers and applause from the citizens of Enchantia. The kingdom buzzed with excitement about the extraordinary opera starring Princess Sophia. The mischievous fairy Twinkletoes watched from the shadows, pleased with the joy she had brought to the kingdom. That night, as Princess Sophia lay in bed, reflecting on the unexpected turn of events, she couldn't help but smile. The morale of the story, she realized, was that sometimes, life takes us on unplanned journeys, and it's our attitude and willingness to embrace the unexpected that can turn challenges into the most magical moments. The citizens of Enchantia learned that laughter and joy could be found even in the midst of surprises and mishaps. And so, the tale of Princess Sophia's impromptu opera performance became a beloved story in the kingdom, reminding everyone that a little spontaneity and a lot of laughter can make life truly enchanting. Thanks a bunch for sharing this fairy tale with us. We had a blast, and we hope you did too. Remember to give that like button a friendly tap and hit the subscribe button so you won't miss out on more fantastic tales and giggles. Can't wait to see you again soon for another round of storytime fun.